Next up, Devin Wade. Uh, it's been a year now since Wade made a name for himself on the hit show Long Shot, but now he's been signed by the Dallas Cowboys. How about that? And a year ago, I would have said Wade's got a shot at a decent NFL career, but let's be honest, this last year has been really rough on him. At least he's on a team, unlike his buddy Colt Cruz. Yeah, but you got to give Colt some credit. I mean, he gave up a shot at the Super Regional Combine to help his buddy Devin Wade out when he needed him most. That's true, but would we even be talking about him if he wasn't on that show? He <laughs> barely made it out of rookie minicamp last year. Yeah, but, but I think Cruz Cruz has some talent. We would have seen Cruz missile launch right out of the Super Regional. Yeah, sure, he got some exposure on the show, but that could ultimately cost him in the long run. Nate, there's nothing wrong with being on reality. <laughs> <laughs> of course you would say How that. How dare you? How dare you? Now, Peter, who has the best shot of these guys to make it? You know, I'm Mike Schmizniak. That's Schmiz. right, I'm a Schmiz guy. <laughs> no way. Yes. Not a chance. Look, he had the best numbers of any of those contestants. Okay. Don't sleep on the Schmiz. <laughs> okay, you're talking about numbers. Football is much more than numbers. I mean, Schmitty is a beast on the field, but that attitude, though, hey, listen, that's a non starter in my book. All right, Burleson, so who's your pick? You know who I stand by? Who? Colt Cruz, baby. Right. I'll give you a name. Sergeant Carrick. Yeah. I'm a big Sergeant yes. Carrick guy. Let's, yes. When the show went back to Wade's old army unit and Wade and Cruz got to go Iron Man against Dan Marino, it's Carrick. She more than held her own against her fellow soldiers. NFL scouts out there, take note of this lady. Here, here. Thank yes. You. Does she even have a first name? Yeah, Sergeant. Sarge for sure. Sarge, Sarge, yeah. All right, in all seriousness, do you guys see a future in the NFL for these two? Yeah, listen, the window is short after college. You normally get two seasons to catch on. I say it's do or die for mm. Cruz. And Wade, it's been a year now. He hasn't been cut, but it looks like no team in the NFL trusts him to actually take an NFL snap. That show made him a household name, and he's had training from top talent. Dan Marino, mm. ever heard of him? How about Coach Jack Ford? Yeah, and the Cowboys are the ultimate show, and they clearly see something. I mean, he's going to have to prove himself, but I genuinely think we're going to see him on the field there. I do. I'm rooting for him. Now just one of 90 players vying for a roster spot, but the question does remain, guys. Can the long shot continue to defy odds and be one of the Cowboys' final 53? Listen, we're going green, right, strong. Slot spider, two wide banana. Got it? Uh, got it, Coach. Go. That's what we got, long shot. Okay, all right, here we go, guys. All right, we're going to go. Um... Oh, no, that's real good. Coach loves QB who take their time. No, I got it, I got it. All right, we're going, we're going red, quads right, a slot, a spider, two wide banana. Is that even a play? Sounds like what I had for breakfast. Get out of here, man. Hey, come on, man. You know this is football, right? See it over there? It's the other team. You want to call a play now? Come on. Okay. Uh. 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 uh, uh what are we? Hey, say we going past 94, punch X, deep cross. All right, here we go. Check that. Here we go, guys. Eyes on me. All right, we're going past 94, punch X, deep cross. Pass 94, punch X deep cross. On two, on two. Ready, break! break. Guess we'll see if he knows what that means. Look, 
What play was that? Uh, it was past 94, a uh, bunch, and I had the, uh, the ex solo cross. We went over this in OTAs already. How are you ever gonna beat a real NFL defense? You don't even know what play we're running. Take a seat, son. Yeah, you lasted longer than me on long shot, but uh, it's real football now, bud. <laughs> you keep telling yourself that, Mike. <laughs> telling you. So. It's a long shot. I'm a long shot. Ooh. Oh, hey, man. No more spots tonight. Why don't you try back next week, though? Yeah, sure. No spots tonight. Same thing. Every time. Shoot you. Be the Bengals. Be the Bengals. You have one new message. Yeah, Colt. Joe King over the Cincinnati Bengals. Yes. We all appreciate the many, many calls and voicemails. <laughs> and yeah, we had a chance to look at your tape. But right now, we just don't have a place for you. Just keep working, stay in shape. You know, someone's gonna call it. Uh, eh, might even be us, but I just want to be clear that there is no reason to call me or anyone else on the scout team. I, I don't think I can overstate that enough. Love the enthusiasm. Again, don't call us, we'll call you. Good luck, Cole. I didn't even call that much. <laughs> Mind if I sit? Suit yourself. Come back soon, now, Billy. Oh, okay. <laughs> don't, don't leave that, don't leave. It must be nice. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't trade it for the world. Oh, come on now. You give up the whole world, play a two-bit club? Well, you know what I was doing before this? It's bagging groceries in Anniston, Alabama. Singing in the shower on the side. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Now, I know the crowds ain't always the biggest. Sometimes they're downright mean. I miss my daughter like crazy. But if this is for the long haul, I'm up for it. You know? Yeah. You get it. You know, there ain't no easy glory. You gotta love it or it ain't worth trying. And I tell you what, giving it everything I got before I ask another person, do you want paper or plastic? <laughs> you know, it's just, I just had it in my head that I'd get up on that stage and I'd start singing and that crowd would just eat it up, you mm -hmm. know, and they'd know the words <laughs> and I'd hold out the microphone and they'd sing along. <laughs> Just starting to realize it probably be like no. <laughs> crickets. <laughs> <laughs> Billy, Billy, you have a second? Sure. Yeah. You need me too? I'm ready. Maybe next week. Hey, you open the door with that long shot song. Now you just need another one. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> hey, thanks. And break a leg. Thank you. <laughs> just need another one. Just. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome back need to the stage. Bill and Mac. I'm going to. Those blue cheese fries with a fried pepper. Son, didn't no one ever teach you to bar an F? Who 
the heck are you? You don't recognize your own daddy? <laughs> are you kidding me here? Where are the cameras at? You, you filming this right now? Because this, <laughs> this here is some of the most cliche crap I've ever seen in my life. Son gets a little success and his dad beat dad who he's, he's never even met before shows up out of the blue. Wow, well, I got some news for you, sir. I'm broke. Yeah, I spent all my money out here trying to play gigs. Don't even know if I got enough money to get me home, so. Well, that is a shame. All I'm asking is 10 minutes of your time. No, thank you. Listen. Just meet me tomorrow at that diner off Old 71 South. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm not gonna be hungry. Ten minutes. Then you won't ever see me again. I'll give you five, and then I'm gone. And don't ever call me son. They ain't plays today, but they ain't stopping us tonight. Ah, oh, man, this might be the only time we get it. Set! 345! Set! Ho, 58! Cowboys training facility. I'm looking at Devin and Tito. They're practicing at night. What? They're doing everything they can. That, that's uh. what pros do. I'm, I'm sneaking in. I gotta go. Gotta go. Randy? Where are you? Don't worry about it. Why? Just put me on speaker. It's on. A guy just walked in. He's, uh, kind of doofy looking. He's got a head like a squished up pumpkin. Looks like me, except not so handsome. I imagine he looks a little lost. Do you see him? Yeah, I see him. Well, tell him to sit down. Um, excuse me. Uh, sit down, I guess. Me? Cole! Colt, sit down! Of course. <laughs> there you are. I wanted the two of you to meet. Where the heck are you? I'll get to that part. But first off, Lo, this is your half-brother, Colt. Wait, I... I'm adopted? No. This is your half-sister, Loretta. What? I want to pause for a moment so you can figure that out. Okay, so some good news, and I think you're both going to be real happy for me. Yeah, fat chance. Here we go. This just in. I booked a tour. 30 cities over four months. Opening for the opener. I'm on the poster and everything. It's kind of a big deal, guys, and I'm not hearing a lot of reaction. Well, what does that mean for me? Which brings me to the best part of this situation. You are going to stay with your brother. What? Wait, why can't I just come with you? Now, from my vantage, this is an ideal situation. Gives you two some time to spend quality time together, really get to know each other. This is crazy. Why can't I come? What'd you say? I, I'm, my call's breaking up over here. We can hear you just fine. What'd you say? I'll call you. I'll call you later. I'll call you from the road. We can catch him. Let's go. He's gone. You know what you want? I just need a minute to process all this, okay? Okay. It's not that complicated. Could you just give us a minute, please? <sighs> Sorry. <sighs> Sorry. 
So. What's your name again? Loretta. Colt. We'll be rotating all four quarterbacks tonight. I'm in charge of you two. Execute exactly what I say you play. You don't? And no reps? That's right. We level. All right, here we go, fellas, eyes on me. Okay, let's go ace trips right, flex, stretch right. Oh, come on, man, you gotta toss that thing up. Make a name for yourself, baby. What? Ain't nobody making this team if we handing it off. Come on, let the thing fly. All right, hey, all right, hey guys, here we go. We're gonna go check alert, 82, X cross, deep post, okay? X cross, deep post, 82 protection, all right? Here we go, ready, ready. ready. Hey, good call, long shot. I'd stay away from Earl Coates if I was you. You gotta earn these guys' respect before they listen to anything coming out your mouth. But I don't think you're ready for it. But we gotta make a decision between you and Smitty. You'll be playing a couple of drives tomorrow night, but a repeat of the day and you're gone. Hey, Devin Wade, can I get your autograph? Oh, yeah, yeah, of course. What's your name, man? Connor. Connor. Dude, Connor. Thanks for coming out, bud. Cool. Oh, kid, don't let Camp Arm ride on your stuff. Cool! There you go. You know, his signature's gonna be worthless in about a week. Cool. But now, right. you got a ball worth something. Cool. Devin. Yeah, what's up, bud? Tell Colt he's the best. Will do. Do you have a charger? Uh, this thing's old school. Sorry. <laughs> do have a Twitter though. It's Colton Cruz eighty one. Got at least two hundred something followers. <laughs> You on that? Social media? Some Twitter or Facebook or anything? Tumblr. Ah! Tumblr. Cool. <laughs> Do you like, uh, tigers? What? T oh. They're fine. Music. Everybody likes music, right? <laughs> what, you listen to Pop? Pop, pop Station? Oh, these guys are fun. <laughs> uh, All these lights, they can't blind me. Something so that nobody can drag me down. Come on. Oh, you know it. Nobody, nobody. <laughs> nobody can drag me down. What's going on? 
Uh, nothing. I just, um, I got a tinkle real quick. I I'll be right back. <laughs> okay. Mom, hey, it took you forever to call me back. I'm in Port Aransas. I've got my own things going on. Yeah, well, I am up to my shirt collar and problems here. Oh, stop talking and start telling me. Okay. Well, I don't know how to say this. I saw Dad earlier today. Oh, just what I need. What did he want? Asking for money, no doubt. No, it's more complicated than that. You see, he dropped his... Uh, dropped his daughter off with me. His daughter? Yeah, Loretta. Why didn't you ever tell me about her? Well, I can't tell you about what I don't know. Look, I, I gotta go. No, wait, 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 wait. I, I, I need your help here. I don't know what I'm doing. Well, how's that different than any other time? Figure it out and call only if it's an emergency. No, but Mom, this is an emergency. Ugh. Oh, oh yeah, sure. Just kick me on them down. That's awesome. Great. Can we go? Just, it's like Children of the Corn out here. Just hold your horses for a second. I'll, I'll be right there. Oh, please help me. Please help me. You good? Uh, no, I'm not sure. Just got a weird text from home. Cause I ain't got time for no quarterback loss and his personal problems. Sarkos, I'm, I'm good. Your career's on the line and you out here playing tiddlywinks while Smitty's in there studying, but oh, you're good, okay. And you, with the snide remarks for every darn thing, you need to keep your mouth shut. I just left a meeting sticking up for you two dipsticks. And neither of you have shown me nothing. Zero. Zero. Except maybe you don't belong. I would take good enough, but you're not even that. Uh, excuse me, can I, uh, interrupt for a second? I hate to interrupt. I'm in the middle of something. Just need you for one second, Earl. Just a second. Excuse me, guys. You okay? I'm level. Let's not pretend we both see eye to eye. You got your way in there with Coach. Fine. You two have a history together. Well, he and I have a history, too. I'm not the only one losing patience, Earl. You got one week. Excited to see that arm, Big D. Schmiz. We both have the same goal, Earl. Let's get on the field. I thought we were I supposed to I said move go. now. Let's go. Yeah. Well, here we are. Home sweet home. <laughs> I know it ain't much. What? thought your phone was dead. It is. I guess I could clean this place up a little bit. <laughs> you think? Um, yeah, well, those those are all clean. I just, you know, I haven't folded them yet. And, uh, well, that's... Oh. Easy! Look at that. Yep. All cleaned up. Okay. Um, now, for where you are going to sleep tonight, uh, down the hall on the right side is Devin's room. I just would tell you to open a window because it's probably a bit dusty in there. Or you could just be cool on the couch. I'm just too tired to think about how filthy this place is. Okay. Well, just uh, make sure you're comfortable <laughs> and get a good night's sleep because tomorrow's a big day, you know, because uh, tomorrow we are going to get you registered for school. Right? That's something you need to do. Night. And uh, 
See you in the... Whatever. No, no, no. Hold on, Sharon from the Double Nickel, who? No, 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 no. Huh. Boom. Hey there, um, long time no talk, <laughs> sorry about that, by the way, um, hey, I am in a situation with my teenage sister that I didn't know I had, <laughs> and before things completely fall apart here, I was hoping you might have a, just a minute to talk, please, um, Oh, it's Colt, by the way. Uh, Cruz, the guy who's too slow to cover you. Hey. <laughs> Bye. <sighs> that could have gone better. Devin Wade finally going to get a chance to show Cowboy fans what he can do, and I'm sure it helps. It's in front of the home fans. Yeah, and he's hoping that these home fans can lift him along. But let's face it, Brandon, he's probably only going to get a series or two. He's got to do Catch something. as well. Good connection. Yeah, I like what you mentioned, the key part of it, a new set of downs. Touchdown, Devin the Flavors. Well, there we go, a successful drive for Devin Wade. Will that be enough to impress the coaches, especially the watchful eye of Earl Coates? The touchdown helps, but a lot of people have tried to impress that man. Not many have succeeded. I don't have to explain myself to you, Donnie. Well, if the coach keeps listening to you over me, then you do. I say who's ready to play. When is that going to be, week 15? Look, it's my job to evaluate talent. How am I supposed to do my job if you won't put Devin on the field? Devin, you're ready to play, right? Yeah, of course, but... Uh... Not his decision. Not your decision. My decision. I say Smitty plays week two. Come on, look. Just... Look, I I've done all the looking I need to. Just uh, give me some flexibility. You want flexibility, do yoga. My mind's made up. Hey, Devin, I'm on your side. I want you on that field as much as you do. I appreciate that. And I'm very flexible. I do Bikram yoga. The hot kind. It's not for sissies. Check this out. Look at that. It's pretty good. Find one on the GM that could do this. Seriously. Now think about that. Now help me get out of it. You okay? I'm stuck. Seriously, can you help me? Yeah. Just Thank does. you. Either arm. That's good. It's good right there. Easy. Ah! Don't let me do that again. Come on. All right. See you later, Donnie. See ya. Hopefully on the field. See that one? <laughs> That's from when I broke Mathis' all-time yardage record. Well, didn't really break it. More like shattered it. <laughs> and then there's this one. The big one in the middle. That is the cream de la cream. <laughs> that is from when we won the Texas State 3A Championship. <sighs> Not exciting enough. What if I told you we were huge underdogs? It was epic. Pretty deep into the second quarter, and we still ain't got no points. It's Katie, 14, both frogs. Big, fat, zero. Has Devin even thrown the ball to Colt? Come on, let's go! Uh, maybe this will be the drive. Better be. It's a state championship, for crying out loud. Come on, Cal! Randy, stop yelling. Man, I am right here. I see you. Brand new drive, first and ten. Let's see what they do. He's a little like a water bug. He ain't big, but just trying to... And he is in Cold Cruise. Oh, oh, Cal, I'm telling you, the chemistry between these two is something special. Go Bullfrogs! Woo! Woo! 
Ooh, that was a knife. Come on now, that's amazing, huh? It's pretty cool. Is he boring you to death with his tall tail? <laughs> <laughs> Nail on the head. <laughs> Coach Hank, this is Loretta. Hi. Hey, hey, well, shouldn't you be in class, young lady? I'm his sister. You're kidding me. Nope, no kidding about it. And she's gonna be staying in Mathis for a little while, so I figured I'd bring her here, get her registered, except, uh... We got way late on memory lane. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, I just, I just got a little lost, <laughs> is all. I haven't been here in a minute. Well, you don't remember how to find the principal's office? I doubt that. <laughs> <laughs> you want me to show you? <laughs> yeah, that sounds great. We finished practice at four. Anytime after that, you're welcome to use the field. You know what? I'll be there, Coach. Well, come by a little early. I'm sure the kids would enjoy hearing war stories from the old days. Okay. Thanks again, Coach. Hey, I'm so happy you called back. Yeah, well, I wasn't going to bother after you blew me off the last four months. But you did sound desperate. I am. I really, really am. I mean, the thing is, I don't know anything about kids or teenagers or, if I'm being honest here... Girls? Yeah. <laughs> or women, clearly. Okay, hey, now. I knew enough to get your number, didn't I? You got me there. <laughs> Okay, I'll help. Yes. What do you have in the house? Uh, you mean like furniture? No, I mean like vegetables, dummy. You need to stock the fridge. Cook instead of takeout, you know, like an adult. Yeah, I mean, don't kids just like Pop-Tarts? Yeah, Cole, kids just want Pop-Tarts. Okay. All right, okay. I'll do it your way. All right? I mean, beyond that, don't judge. Girls got enough they're up against. All right. I'm sage advice. You know, I think I got this now. Good. And if that fails, you can always have her call me. Really? Does that mean I can call you too? I guess. <laughs> Okay, Wade, you need an invite? No, sir. No, sir. Second week of the preseason, and Devin Wade will get a second opportunity under center with the Cowboys. They kind of peeled back the curtain for us. They said he's just going to get one drive again in this game, like last week. And I thought that... And that looked like some pretty easy yardage there right up the gun. And he's a guy that has some height to him, so when you don't have to drop a shoulder... Tito Flavors from Devin Wade. Touchdown! But well, Devin Wade leads the offense into the end zone, and even though we are seeing such a small sample size, that really has to help his chances going forward, right? No doubt about it, because it's a start. Not much of one, but it's definitely a start for him. But let's face it, how many people know who the fourth string quarterback is? Not many. I mean, we... You know, a lot of quarterbacks come into this league, look the part, have the big arm and all that crap they test at the combines. You know how many of those guys last? Not many. You got your shot because you look like a player, but if it doesn't click up here, you think about what I said.
All right, we're running the opponent's offense against our base D. Let's go. Stick to the cards, nothing fancy. Need any help? Nope, I got this. I I definitely got it. Yes, siree. No doubt uh, about it. Help me, please. <laughs> you know you could just look this up on YouTube. Yeah, but then I wouldn't be seeing you, so nope. Okay. Are you sure you're okay in there? Yep, I am all good. Hey, I gotta go. Okay. All right. <sighs> Dinner is served. <clears throat> Okay, there you go. Thanks. Yep. So is that your girlfriend on the phone? What? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> hmm, it's a shame. She seems nice. If you take a picture, it'll last longer. Oh, <laughs> I'm sorry. I just... Good. You like it? I mean, it's okay. Oh, that is good. <laughs> I mean, I mean, it's fine. It's just, just like I usually make. <laughs> Dad never tried to cook. Well, that does not surprise me. <laughs> Although, I guess I really don't know him all that much. When did he leave? Last three or four. I don't remember anything about him, except for this one picture I got when I'm sitting on his lap and he's got his guitar in front of me. He's you know, teaching me how to play, I guess. <laughs> and now you play? And now I play. Did the same thing with me. I refuse to play. Yes, I blew it. Well, I mean, it's never too late to learn. I could teach you some chords. I am a big star in Finland, you know. Oh, I had no idea. You've never mentioned it other than all the freaking time. All right, all right, Tell all right. Tell me more. <laughs> Thanks, though. You got it. Just one day after Dallas cut down to three quarterbacks by releasing Mike Schmizniak, the Cowboys are now back to four, feeling the need to add veteran insurance after losing their backup to an MCL tear. Ooh. Boy, you hear this? They're bringing in RG3 to take your spot. And in all, Brandon Whedon's coming in, too. Man, from third, second, fourth. All in a day's work, huh, Rook? tell her to deal with it well then you deal with it because i'm at work right now yeah well tell lily i love her and to deal with it all right i gotta go i gotta go hey dev how are you donnie you got a sec for dev and wait anytime come on have a seat thanks can i get you some uh hyperion oh no i'm good it's ionized <laughs> it's the kind of crap they give you in this business they give you cases of it anyway you're better off Tastes like lemon-infused nothing. So what's up? Okay, so so Earl said I would be playing Saturday. But now it looks like... I know, I know. Well, after the game, Earl and I had a powwow, and he felt we needed alternatives. Hey, you're frustrated, and I'm frustrated. You know? Here's the way I see it, okay? This is you. You're here. This is your NFL career. All right? Better looking, better looking friends. Your old friends asking to borrow money. Bigger homes. Jewelry for everybody, including me. And this is Earl. Getting in the way of all that. Okay? 
Look, you probably think I don't like Earl. I respect the heck out of him. All right? But at a certain point, the old guard has to get out of the way and let the new guard get in there. Look, I'm the one that brought you in here. I know. I want you out there. You've waited long enough. I mean, I agree. I feel ready. You look ready. Can I ask you one question? Yeah, of course. Does, um... Earl seem a little off to you? You know, like, uh... He's struggling a little bit. Wait, so... You want me to spy on Earl? Hey, slow down, Mr. Bond. I'm just saying. If you see something, say it. See it, say it. That's all. all right. Donnie, man, thanks for the time. I better get out to practice. Okay, buddy. Want to be late, right? All right. See you out there. All right, catch you next time. Hans, what are you stretching for? Are you going to cover me? Oh, I'm going to try. <laughs> <clears throat> uh, Mr. Cruz? Hey, guys. Hey, man. Hey, I, you mind if I get an autograph, Mr. Cruz? If we get an autograph? Uh, you're my favorite bullfrog. We've we all, we all seen you play here. Then you've seen us. I'm Mons. This here's Geese. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, sure. Um, we're just big fans of Longshot. And you see the draft episode. <laughs> Look, uh, I don't know why you'd want something, but yeah, I'll, I'll sign something for you. Well, we don't, we ain't, we ain't got nothing on us. I just thought I'd ask. Yeah, well, I appreciate that, guys. Um, would you mind if we joined your practice? I mean, your friends are just, I don't know, what I'm saying is, we're athletes. <laughs> sure. Wanna do a little seven on seven? You know what, guys? All this commotion, it's got my thyroid acting up. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I'm his ride, so I guess uh, I gotta go too. Yeah, I saw this coming. <laughs> Seriously, guys, come on. Air coat. We'll play. No way. Come on. Don't be such a wimp. Uh, Mr. Cruz, I don't know if it's such a good idea. Yeah, Lo, I, I don't want you getting hurt, okay? Uh, that's not. These guys haven't won a game, come on. I'm sure we'll be fine. Ooh. <laughs> uh, okay, then, come on down. Hey, what's the deal with your friend, the one that was throwing darts out there? Why isn't he on the team? You're so clueless. <laughs> why? Oh, oh, oh. I get it. I get it. I see why you like Dylan. Barely ever opens his mouth. <laughs> He's deaf, Colt. What? Yeah. He's new here, and when he signs, people make fun of him. But he throws the ball so well that... Oh, way to miss the point. Gosh, you are so insensitive. You don't understand Wait, anyone but yourself. You don't care about anyone. Wait a minute, what, what did I say? Ugh. What did I say? <coughs> oh, gosh. Hey. Hey, give me that. Are you okay, Coach? I'm fine. Leave it. Hey, Coach, are you sure you're okay? Would be better if you didn't go behind my back. You're always against me. Uh, what's that? I didn't hear you. Speak up. Nothing. You got something to say to me, son. Have a spine and say it to my face. I said you're always against me. Against you? <laughs> against you. You know my wife, Wanda, she couldn't have kids. It's the reason why I got into this in the first place. 
because I wanted to be a father to someone. But once you're in, you realize there's a lot of decline. High school, you're chasing college. College, you're chasing the pros. Linebacker's coach, you got to be defensive coordinator. Defensive coordinator, you got to be head coach. Better pay, better position, better team, more prestige. And I'm saying to my wife, look, this will be hard, but next year there'll be more money. Next year there'll be more time. And she waited for me, but there was never next year. Now I can't do anything about it. I'm far from what I wanted and I haven't been a father to nobody. And now my wife's gone. I can barely hear or walk around cockeyed, hands shaking, and for what? Grown men chasing a ring. You know, I've never been a head coach. Never won a Super Bowl. But what does it matter? My life. <laughs> you never get it back, son. You never get it back once it's gone. Coach, I'm really sorry, man. That's all right, that's all right. Look, you can go. You sure you don't want me to? No, 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 leave it. You can go. All right. And listen, after this, don't think you know something or that I'll be playing favorites, because I won't. No, of course not. All right, Coach. If we merge their state money, public funding in Beville, and we can play in a stadium these boys deserve. And then you just want to what? Abandon the Mathis football legacy? I mean... Oh, cult, please. Uh, let me get one thing straight here. Now, seems to me that the first step in that is finding out the value of things. And the value of things has nothing in the world to do with uh, green-colored paper. <laughs> value of this team is not something you can touch. Not something you can hold in your hand. Unless, <laughs> of course, we're talking about uh, the uh, state uh, championship trophy, and you can hold that in your hand. <laughs> now, what I'm talking about is a feeling that I have from my toes to the last hair on my head to the core of my heart. It's a feeling of pride, of value to this town. Now, if we have to merge and move, then we have to merge and move. But if there are avenues that we have not explored, for God's sake, let's explore them. Let's try to find out who we are before we mortgage our soul for something as measly as money. <laughs> I've kept you long enough. <laughs> oh. Can I get you something? Like a you who? <laughs> if, if I've got any advice for you, Don't age. <laughs> since, since you're going to be hanging around here, I figured you might want to make a little extra money. And uh, I need a, an assistant coach. The boy seemed to like you pretty well. <laughs> uh, <laughs> well, Coach, I, I appreciate the offer. I really do, but I don't know how long I'm going to actually be hanging around Mathis. I mean, I figure any day now an NFL team can call and I got to be ready to go, you know? Okay. Fetch what's important. 
So what? So I can't do what Devin's doing? Why don't you get on the phone, call him? Tell him to come home. Offer him a job, huh? Uh, don't get yourself all lathered up. I'm just offering to let you do something for pay. I figure if you're tearing up my field every evening, then you might as well help with a little practice. But if it'd kill you to do that, <laughs> do that then uh, that's all right. But I'm not a spring chicken anymore. I could use the company. Look, Coach, I'm... I got a little riled up in there. I just, just know I'm happy to help. But anything long term, I, I can't promise that. What? Yeah, sometimes you miss what's important by having your eye trained on something else. Okay, what are you saying? Oh, just an old man talking. <laughs> At the big screen, you know it's huge. It's not toe drag swag, it's not angry runs, but it's your take, Nate, on a guy you know yeah. you love, long shot Devin Wade. What do yeah. you got? Yeah, Wade's got one preseason game left. Common sense tells you with the injury to the back of quarterback, that would have helped, mm. but the team brought in RG3 and Brandon Whedon, which means he went from second string to fighting for a third string roster spot. Pour one out for RG3. I missed that, man. We need him back, Nate. In the meantime, any other storylines surrounding Wade we should all be looking at? Well, listen, I'm hearing that Wade and my guy, late round draft pick Tito Flavors, yeah! best name in football. Football. Best name in the world. Listen, I heard they got great chemistry, so we'll see if that goes from the practice field to an actual preseason game. Tito Flavors has all the flavors, the Neapolitan ice cream of football players. Thank you, Nate. Two long shots looking to make a difference. So, uh, I am going to be helping Hank out with the team for a little bit, and I was wondering if Dylan might want to play. I mean, Lord knows we could use him. I don't know. Why don't you try asking him? Uh, because I don't speak hand. Sign language. Or that. <laughs> he can read lips. And I can teach you some sign language if you want it. That sounds fun. Put me on your roster. Although I have been told I am dumber than a bucket full of hammers, <laughs> so until that point, I might need your help coaching him. Coaching? You mean it? Yeah. Better together, right? I, 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 you gotta do it three times like this. One, two, three, and then. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shoot, I am so late. I gotta go see coach. Well, then let's go. Well, this final preseason game, always interesting. Guys fighting for those final few roster spots, and here comes Devin Wade, one last chance to make a lasting impression. And he has to get that playing time tonight, and let's face it, this is where we are. Guys on the bubble trying to make the team, and there are a bunch of guys who are not going to make the team, but they're playing, hoping someone will see them on film Six, three, and pick them up if they 80. get cut. So it's a huge night for them. Yeah, that offense could score some points. To throw on second down, Wade, and it's caught. Touchdown! Well, that's the big drawback to this play. Even if somehow the quarterback pitches it, he's not immune to the big hit. In this case, he kept it and absorbed it anyway. All right, we've been setting them up for this play all night. They're going to be in a cover, too. So you take a five-step drop, find Reggie on the sideline. When he breaks the corner, you sling it. We'll get out of here with a win. All right, let's do it. Hey, look for your boy on the post. I'll be open. Hey, it's not the play, man. Come on, Wade. It'll work, man. And you need this. Just let Tito be Tito. All right, here we go, fellas. Eyes on me. All right, we're gonna go red, right, 82, buzz, wide corner. Check alert, Ozzy right, opposite, 27, Cardinal. All right, on three, on three. Who's right with me, boys? Here we go, ready, break! Come on, man, I'm telling you, find me, I'll catch it. A lot of tired bodies on that field, but this is a big play, third and goal. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. Touchdown, Tito Flavors, courtesy of Devin Wade. 
Congratulations, we're keeping you around. What? <laughs> Practice squad at first. But you keep doing the work, and I don't think you'll be there long. <laughs> oh, thank you, Coach. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, Coach. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> nice job, Camp Arm. Welcome to the team. Hey, Mac. Welcome to the scout team, gentlemen. Your job is to get the defense ready for what they'll see on Sunday. Wade, you got a tough job this week. We're facing Tom Brady, the greatest. We need you to be him today. Got it. Launches the ball 80 yards. Absolutely incredible. <laughs> Hello? Wait, seriously? Yeah, that's that's great. Wow. Um well you can bring as many guys as you want in, but I'm gonna impress you the most. <laughs> Tomorrow. Uh, yeah, absolutely. I, I can be wherever you need me to be. Okay, thank you. Come on, pick up, pick up. Dolphins called, Coach. Bringing me out for a tryout tomorrow. Coach. Coach. Hank. Hank! Wake up! Stay with me, coach. Help! Help! Somebody help! Hey, Donnie, you wanted to see me? Hey, Dev, come on in. Yep. Have a seat. What's up? Well, the last time you were here was the superstar you. <laughs> I just want to play, coach! Then there was Grumpy Earl. Oh, I need Devin to do a hundred more push-ups. And then there was me, a beacon of support, an unconditional love. I support Devin. I'm in his team. I'm the one who signed him. Okay. Now imagine that viral video as some sort of rocket fuel jetpack. Oh, no! Devin's succeeding. Oh, we can't have that. Where's my value? Oh, don't overshoot your landing. We're a team. We're in this together. I'm the one aside. And that's exactly what happened. I set you up with that viral video. Rocket fuel. But now my hands are tied. You get it, right? Um, uh, yeah. I, you, um. All right. I'll spell it. I'll spell it out for you. You've been signed over from our practice squad by the Houston Texans. You leave tomorrow. <gasps> I thought we were a team. Wow, you. But I guess congratulations are in order. You got what you wanted. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Oh man. Is, uh, is, is Earl in his office? I wanted to tell him thanks before I... No. He resigned this morning. His health. Take this. Oh, I'm gonna need it. For the next guy. Something to remember him by. Thanks. Hey. Good luck, kid. 
Welcome back to Good Morning Football. So, the Texans stumble out of the gate. Bill O'Brien takes a season-long leave of absence. They lure NFL legend Bill Cowher out of retirement to finish the year and then make a huge trade for Antonio Brown. All that only to have franchise quarterback Deshaun Watson go down for at least the next three weeks. So the question is, can Devin Wade help this team stay afloat until Watson returns? You're the one responsible for them keeping me here. Coach. Can't move on your left side like at all. I can still move better than most. Oh, that nap it. It's gonna be a minute. Till that minute's up, I guess you're gonna have to coach the team. Coach, I, I, I can't. The whole reason I, I even found you in your office is because I was coming to tell you that the Dolphins are giving me a tryout. I mean, this, <laughs> this could be my last chance here. I'm not begging you. I'm asking you. Adult to adult. Coach, I, I told you. Yeah, maybe you did. When I was a boy, all I ever wanted to do was ride bulls. <laughs> That's what I did for three years. On tour from Kissimmee to Calgary. It's a wonder I didn't break my dang neck. I did break my back. I come home, wallowed around. Oh, I don't know how long. Till a fella came and offered me an opportunity I didn't think I wanted. I thought, well, I'll, I'll heal up and get back on tour. And then I thought about it. I thought about my real situation. Then I took that job the next day. <laughs> uh, it might seem funny hiring a bull rider to teach my high school football. But it was a different time in those days. And uh, must have been some smarts to it because I've been coaching in Mathis for 30 years. <laughs> I gotta say, it's the best thing that ever happened to me. The close second was that girl kissing me on the head when I took a bad fall at the Chico Ranch. <laughs> <laughs> but all of this has very little to do with importance of winning this game, saving the team. All the work I've done. Flushed away in an instant. I can't. You can't what? I can't stay, Coach. I gotta go see what I'm worth here. Don't let them decide. And the 
final analysis, you are the one that's got to make the decision. I know. Look, I can talk to Geese about coaching the team, or, no, no, or maybe. No, no, I'll, I'll take care of you. You go ride your ball. Thank you, Coach. I just have to know. I disagree, but I do understand. See you when you back up on your feet. Hey. Hey. Why are you packing? Dolphin's cold. I gotta try out Miami tomorrow. What if you make it? <laughs> then I'll be a Miami Dolphin, baby. Yeah, but where will you live? Uh, Miami, I assume. What about me? Uh, I don't know. I guess uh, we'll, we'll just call your dad, okay? You're joking. Right, please tell me that you're joking. You don't even have his number. Look, I ain't got that far, okay? This is so stupid. It's not stupid for me. You're not even any good. If you were, you'd already be on a team. Okay, I'm not the one who's any good here? Am I the one whose father dropped her off with a complete and total stranger, huh? You're just like him. Look, I didn't... You are mean, selfish, and stupid! Well, I didn't ask for this, okay? I had a plan here. It's all my fault. I actually thought you cared about me. <laughs> oh, come on. I can't believe it. You're actually gonna go. <laughs> Loretta, please understand, I gotta do this. And, and I can find someone to look after you while I'm gone, okay? Gentlemen, injuries have made it, so we're looking for a receiver to join us right away. We're looking for speed, good hands, and a willingness to go over the middle. If all goes well, one of you will be a Miami Dolphin by noon. <laughs> Okay? Um, not really, Coach. Well, I've got some good news that'll cheer you up. Welcome to the Dolphins. I made it? Yeah. Coach liked your speed. Well, thank you, Coach. Um, I'm gonna let you down. You'll see. All right. Let's get you upstairs and do some paperwork. 
I'll be up in just a second. Yes, sir. Helmet. You're gonna need it. Yes, coach. All right, look at this. Coming in to return the punt, the former long shot co star Colt Cruz just signed this week by the Dolphins. Here's Lachlan Edwards now. And no room for air here as his first punt comes from deep in his own end zone. Yes, coach. Get in there, slot receiver. Make some plays. I might let you stay in. Yes, sir, coach. <laughs> well, the Dolphins, look here. They're making a substitution. They're going to trot Colt Cruz out at wide receiver. Another chance for him to make an impression. Yeah, and that's what his night captain is batting down the hatches time defensively. Dodge two pass attempts to the end zone. Now, what do you think they're going to try and dial up on third and goal? Well, knowing them and knowing what we just seen, I think they're throwing it again, don't you? I think you have to. I think in this situation, you've kind of run out of your running plays. Fire another one into the end zone. Cruz, I think we've seen enough for today. Sit down. Or coach, sit down. Oh my God. Loretta! Yeah? I, I found him. Wait a minute, Lowe's here? Cole? She needed to be here, Cole. <laughs> Loretta, listen. Hey, I know I should have never left Mathis. I, I am so sorry. If you care about people. You don't, you don't just leave them. I know. I know. Guess what? I'm not letting you get rid of me. How about that? I talked to Cash, and we agreed that I could move down here with you. She's serious, Colt. You know, Mathis ain't going nowhere. <laughs> you know, I'd love that. But they cut me. Sorry. You gonna get him next time, son. <sighs> All right, Hank. I just need you to give me a sign or something. I can't believe that. I can't believe I'm talking about head right now. I just need something. Can't do this. Right? <gasps> Look, I'm freaking out, man. You need to get in there. What's the score? We're down twenty-eight, nothing. <sighs> okay. Hey, here, take this. He wanted you to have it. I can't take that, man. Fine. Then I'll hold on to it till you're ready. <sighs> Y'all mind if I come in? I know you're hurting over Hank. And I know I should have been here, but I, I wasn't. Because I was, well, I was being a selfish jerk. But I'm back. And I am here now, and I want to help. If you'll let me. Now, I may not know what the future holds, but I know that we got a lot more fight left in us. 
and I am asking you right now for the honor of leading you back onto that field and trying to get a win tonight. You can start by moving me to running back and put Dylan in a QB. Okay. You okay with that? He's ready. Wendell, I'll be sending plays in with you. You relay it to the rest of the team. Loretta, sign plays into Dylan, okay? Let me hear four Hank on three. One, two, three! Four Four Hank! Hank. Let's go, baby! Let's go! go. go. Well, what do you know? Folks, looks like we found ourselves a new coach here. He look familiar to you, Randy? Huh? Wait, that's Colt! The cruise missile! Holy cheese fries! Is he taking over? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. That holy cheese fries is my line, Uh, Randy. Hey, where'd he come from? Weren't you telling me Colt was in Miami? That's what I read on the Dolphins message board. Guess it don't matter now. No, it sure don't. That's odd, kind of weird. But yeah, it's a raw deal. We're a pretty small community there. If you haven't noticed, not sure how we can come up with that type of catch. And the man behind this mess, he knows it. Not going to say his name. Because he's one of our biggest sponsors. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's just keep it simple at least, all right? Whatever. Second and goal for the offense. They'll try to run it in with Wendell. We did it! <laughs> we did it! <laughs> Woo-hoo! Oh, 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 Come on, let's go celebrate. Nachos on me! Wow, that's very kind of you, Randy. No, Cal, I meant literally. I spilled the nachos, the cheese is on, on me. It belongs to you now. Better get in there, coach. It's your team now. Thank you, Case. heard what Carlos has to say about the merger. Unfortunately, without Hank here to represent the team. Rest in peace, Hank. But I will open up the floor. This town needs the bullfrogs. This town needs Mathis High School football. It's the fabric of this town. I could tie every single person in this room to the benefits of Mathis football. Not to mention the town itself. I mean, we did win state in 2012, didn't we? (laughs) That was with Hank at the helm. And as much as I hate to say it, this merger is gonna... Oh, hold on now. Just hold on a second. Now, I know I'm no Hank. But I do believe I know what he would say if he were here. He would say what he told us in the locker room every single day. Football is family. And without football, we're no longer a family. Yes, Colt. Mathis football is family. But if there's no Mathis, then where does the family go? As a boy in the Japa de Madero, Mexico, I watched the logging industry dissolve before my eyes, forcing everyone to leave. I can't let that happen to this town that I love, that I call home. So, we merge, we get a stadium deal, I hire half of Mathis to build it, and next thing you know, Mathis is buzzing again. With all due respect, Pops, This ain't Mexico, and you're in it for the money. Mm -hmm. (laughs) Well, mijo, that money is how I acquired 90% of the businesses in this town. And if we continue on the same path, it won't be only the football team that is forced to leave. Is that a threat to the home you say you love so much? Order! Order! 
can't coach. shut us up. Come on now. Sit well, down. either way, we still don't have a coach. Colt will be our coach. No, man. You should do this. I mean, I could be gone in any minute. Give me a second. Are you kidding me right now? Look, my dad knows without Hank, he's got the boat. The only person he's afraid of in here is you. Look, Geese, I can't do it. Okay, I'm a player. I'm not a coach. What are you quit lying to yourself? No one is calling. Hey, I'm done fooling with you. There's bigger things at stake here than you riding the bench on some NFL team. Yeah, well, at least I'm trying, Geese. What exactly are you doing here? I'm here standing up to my father. I'm here standing up for Bullfrogs football. A coach and no money. The state of Texas will give a million towards a joint stadium. Gabriel, what can you offer? We don't need a million dollars for math, this Carlos. Five hundred thousand. I can raise half that. We'll crowdsource it. I'll help. And if we went out, you put up the hundred, two hundred fifty thousand dollars. <laughs> Mi hijo, por favor, come on. This isn't a movie. It's not make believe. Winning doesn't make money fall from the sky. I'm standing right here facing the facts. Yes, you are. Okay. I'll make you a deal. If this team makes the playoffs and the city raises $250,000, I'll match it on one condition. Name it. If the money is raised and this team wins out at the time I hand out the check, Colt must commit to Mathis football by signing a three-year contract. Colt? Yes or no? Everyone's waiting for you. Okay. I'll do it. You know you're better at this than I am? <laughs> nice try. <laughs> hey, boys, come on, bring it in. Come on, on double, on double, let's go. <clears throat> All right, take a knee. Everyone. Now, I know a lot of the talk lately has been, you better win or else. That's not true. What you need to do is focus. Focus on playing hard and playing smart. That's it. I say you're driving across country. Now you ain't gonna do 3,000 miles in a minute. You gotta drive within the headlights. Not worry about what's in front of you. And the next thing you know, you're gonna find success. Cause the next thing you know, you're gonna be in California. Drive within the headlights. You know what? I like that. I like that a lot. So that's what we're going to do. Let me hear focus on three. Go home and get some rest. One, two, three. Focus. Go home and get some rest. No, no just focus. Go home. Scoot over. Let me do this. You can add photos? Yes. This whole time? This whole time. Look it. Drag and drop. We're gonna save Mathis. 
Sure are. Let's drive within those headlights. That's right. Colt is gonna call the same plays Hank always has? Ah, of course he is, Cal. I love Colt, but he's not the brightest kid. He's not the brightest bulb in the bucket. You know, we should be saying, seeing plenty of fullback dives, quarterback draws, maybe a halfback toss in there. I mean, it ain't gonna get crazy. You're not gonna see those razzle-dazzle plays you see in the NFL. Let's go, Bullfrogs! Dylan will throw. He's gonna find his man out of the backfield. That's right on the numbers, and it is complete. And he's got it. Gilbert Fox, touchdown, Bullfrog. Oh, he outboxed him there. <laughs> and that should seal the run. I tell you, Cal, this win just became real, real important. Cal, we're. No, like this. Uh, I'm trying. Here. Mm. Please, please, please donate if you can. It'll feel good. Once. Come on, it will. Donate. Folks, Mathis comes back out and, well, uh, wait a dang minute here. Wendell Chase is back at quarterback. What in tarnation? Dylan must be hurt. Yeah, I don't know what's going on here, but I sure hope Colt has some tricks up his sleeve. This defense is no joke. First and ten for the Bullfrogs. He'll throw. Touchdown! Chase comes through in a big way on the road, Randy. He sure did. Now, you got to give credit to Coach Cruz for switching up the game plan. Gentlemen, we need Great one job, stop. Frog. Keep them out of the end zone here, and we win this game. You want me a corner again? I have to. I need you out there. I want you on 88 all the time. Coach, he's all district. He's like six inches taller than you. I don't care if he shoots lasers out of his butt. You ain't no football dummy. Stay on it. Now, let's go out there, and let's bring this game home. I believe in you guys. Go! Let's go! Let's go, boys! One final drive for the Rancho Banchetti Rattlers. We hold them here, and we come away with the win. Hey, Italian. We need another miracle. Amen. He's gonna throw. Now they set up the screen. That's complete. And he'll push on forward there for a good little game. That was one heck of a stand by the Bullfrogs defense. Man, Cal, they look like the 85 Bears. Man, oh man! So the streak continues, but next week's is crucial. And it's against Beeville. Oh, no. If you pledge $100, you will receive two tickets to the Bullfrogs' final home game and a jar of Lanny Munz's homemade barbecue sauce. Oh, man. Lanny. Tasty. Mm. <laughs> you got to try this. Come here. Uh. <laughs> uh, yeah. Hello. Yeah, sure, I can do that. See you then. Would you like some lemonade? Uh, 
I had the lemons flowing from Argentina. Easier now with the band lifted. <laughs> sure. Oh, please. So why did you call me here? <laughs> Riot to business. <laughs> A man after my own heart. <laughs> well, first, I want to congratulate you on your success. Well, we are three and four now. One went away from fending off that merger, so. That's great. That's great. So, money's raised? Uh, not yet. Still got a little ways to go. But we're winning. And the town has given every penny they can, so I'm confident. Oh, nice. So, you're ready to sign the contract? <laughs> <laughs> no, that is a cross that bridge when we get to it situation. Right now, I'm just focused on Beeville. Oh. And they're seven to one. So there are no guarantees there. Yeah, it's going to be tough. Which brings me to the reason I wanted to meet. I wonder what it is that Colt Cruz wants. Colt Cruz wants to beat Beeville, raise a ton of money, fend off that merger, and then the world is my oyster. <laughs> <laughs> but you see, with your best friend in the NFL, I can't help but wonder, shouldn't Cold Cruz be there too? The NFL? <laughs> yeah. But, uh, Have you heard of uh, Jerry Jones, owner of the Dallas Cowboys? Yeah, I've heard of Jerry Jones, <laughs> Mr. Guzman. Yeah. Well, as a Texas builder, you can imagine I have some connections to him. I'd be very happy to make a call. I get what you're saying. I should follow my dreams. Exactly. So I'll be out of your way. No, Cole. I'm saying follow your dreams so we'll thrive. <laughs> See, this winning has been fun. But it creates distraction, not industry. You don't think I see it, but I know exactly who you are. Taking down portraits of all the bullfrog greats. Taking down portraits of Hank. Oh, Colt. Times change. You're not gonna erase the past. No. But you can look to the future. <laughs> that lemonade sucks. <laughs> With Watson out and Jones shaken up, it appears that we are going to see the NFL debut of rookie Devin Wade. Absolutely unbelievable, partner, because two months ago, we saw Devin Wade play, and we thought he might be cut. Blue, but think 43. about now. Since long shot, where he did struggle with a number of things, that time he spent with Coach Earl Coates has really paid off for him. He's going to need to apply it right here, right now. Great. Once you get into the red zone and the safeties have less ground to cover, you better be quick with your... And got his man. It's caught. Touchdown, Houston. I'm impressed, and I'll be honest, a little bit shocked. The Texans find a way to win, and they do it behind the arm of third-string quarterback Devin Wade. Hey, Devin, you got a second? Yeah, Coach. Let's go in. I'm going to talk to you for a second. Now... I could go on and on about why this game matters or what this game could mean to you in your future or how many people in this town are going to buy you ice cream for a month if we win, but I'm not going to do that. I am going to simplify it for you because it is simple. Get that. I am going to simplify it for you because it is simple. What? I'm trying to coach a game in here. Hey, sorry to interrupt, fellas. Yeah. Uh, you mind if I come in for a second? No, come on, get your butt in here. It's just, uh, I, I brought some friends too, so if they could come in too. I, I don't care who you brought, just get them in here quick. I got a game to coach. All right, coach. Fellas. <clears throat> yeah, just some friends. Coach. Coach. 
Coach Cal. Oh, I mean, uh, Coach. Yeah. <laughs> you, you're, the, you're Deshaun Watson. I sure am. And he's Antonio Brown. What's up, little man? I want to cover you one day. Let him laugh. I'll stay healthy, so you'll get your chance. Look, guys, we just wanted to come down and say, hey, lend our support. Uh, it's, it's a big game for you guys, and uh, Coach Carroll was generous enough to give us the day. So uh, you guys get after him out there. You guys good for autographs after? Yeah, 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 yeah. Right. Good luck tonight, Colt. Uh, Mr. Uh, Coach uh, yeah, Coward, you know. uh, Bill, uh, would you... Uh, you know how big this game is, right? I, I do. I, and because of that, would you mind uh, saying a couple you words? You got this. No, I mean, you, I got you're it. you. I got it, I got it. Good, got it. thank you. Um, okay, <laughs> Listen, I'm going to talk to you guys tonight. Um, you know, Colt and Devin, um, they're you. They came from here. And what they represent are people that never forgot where they came from. And the opportunity that you have tonight is you are part of a game that's more than a game. Yes, I want you to go out there. I want you to play hard. I want you to play smart. I want you to play physical and play together. But what you represent is more than the bullfrogs. You represent a community, Mathis. And you know what you're going to show them tonight? It's about resiliency. What you represent tonight is spirit. If you get knocked down, you get back up. And you show what a community can do when you all come together. That's the opportunity you have tonight. That's the responsibility you have tonight. And I couldn't be more proud and more excited to watch a group of young men bring a community back together. Kick some butt tonight. Go Bullfrogs. Here's one of the benefits of having a coach with some NFL connections, huh? <laughs> I want to hear Mathis on three. One, two, three. Mathis. Mathis. Let's go, baby. Go! Woo! Hey, Colt. You know Devin's not here to bail you out tonight, right? Oh, what a weirdo. Do you guys have history? You don't even want to know. Mario. And then why don't you stop yapping and get ready for the game? Get ready for what? You? Yeah. <laughs> hey, I love the coaching staff, Colt. What you stealing from? Choir? Oh! Okay, we're done. Good oh. luck tonight, Mario. Okay. <clears throat> You're really gonna let him say that stuff? That's just Mario. Yap, 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 yap. Oh. Don't let him get in your head. Trust me on that. <sighs> no mercy rule tonight, bro. But hey, I might take some of your plays and add them to my playbook after the merger, huh? Well, Randy, here we go. The big showdown with Beeville. Oh, man. If we don't win this, we might be playing on their field next season. Yuck. Man, hey, you see who their coach is? Freaking Mario Gonzalez. Really? I can't see that far anymore. Yes, they do, definitely. I know they're, they're, they'll never show my face. It's a policy, evidently. But I love those cutting-edge graphics they give us with the shadows. Now that was a great defensive drive. Huge, Cal. We're back in this thing, but time's running out. We can't waste any more opportunities on offense. Let's go, let's go. Let's go fellas. Listen, guys, listen. I know I'm new to Mathis. If this is the first time in my life, I feel like I have a home. I'm not going to lose this team. Lucas, you've been beating your man all game. Get ready. Gotcha. We're going to march down this field and win this game. Right, Let's go. Not for us, but for this entire town. Yeah. This is our time. Yeah. Let's be bullfrogs. Yeah. All right. This is the play. Going shotgun. 31. Drag out. Post. Ready? Break. Well, here we go. 
as we expected, this one has been back and forth all night. Mathis has one final drive left to steal the win away from Beeville. Come on, coach. Get with it. And here's Fox on third and goal. Touchdown! Touchdown, Bullfrogs! Ha-ha! <laughs> I knew it! They've done it! <laughs> they have done it! <laughs> nobody, nobody <laughs> gave us a chance in this game, Cal. Beeville's ranked 24th in the state. Unbelievable! I can't believe it! We did it! That's how we play. Woo. That's how we do it. Go. Stop. Everybody, listen up. Hey. Listen up. <laughs> oh, man. I want each and every one of you to savor what happened tonight. Because no matter what happens out there, nobody can take this victory away from you. Got that? That's right. Woo. Now, the team, we did our part. And guess what? Town's doing theirs too. Tonight, we raised $3,890, which is way more than anybody else thought we could ever do. And not just that, people beyond this town are giving too. Couple that with what Devin gave and Antonio Brown kicking in another $15,000. Yeah. Man, All right. Now listen up, everybody. I want you to keep believing. Yes, sir. Okay? What this town is doing, what you have done, what people outside this town are doing shows that people believe in us, believe in what we do. And some people are going to tell you that this is a miracle. Well, it's not. It's not. You worked your tails off to earn this, and this is yours, and no one can take that away. To Hank! To Hank! Hey, Munz, how are we doing on those donations? Give me a minute. I'm only one man. You account for this yet? Dang, Nabbit. I lost count. Hey, Geese! Geese, check it out. Deshaun Watson just wrote us a check for $250,000. Everyone, we got an announcement to make. Must this ain't $250,000. I mean, it'd be a lot cooler if it was. Hey, everybody. One Derek Deshaun Watson just gave us $25,000 to Mathis. <laughs> well done. You should all be proud. But I fear this will not end the way you guys hoped. <laughs> we ain't done yet. Still got an hour left. Yeah. Plenty of time. Hey, Cope. What are you doing here, Mario? <laughs> come to catch another whooping? Yeah. <laughs> I come in peace. I swear. Look, as much as we've hated you through the years, <sighs> this rivalry suit us all to be better. We respect the heck out of Mathis football. So after the game, everyone and their parents threw in. It's only 1300 but maybe it'll help. No, oh, every bit helps, Mario. Thank you so much. Yeah. Tell me that don't warm your heart. Even if you only got pennies to give, show them some love. Donate now. You sure you don't want to stay? Something to eat? Something yeah. to drink? Good luck, guys. Thank you again. Thanks again. Hey, you seeing this? Wait, wait, is that for real? I think it is. Hey, guys, what's happening? Antonio Brown's video's gone viral. Pepsi just retweeted it. Huh. And they just posted a YouTube video about us. Huh. 50K, 50 more K. Oh, my gosh. Oh, come on. Come on, come on. Oh! Take a look at that! Oh, look at those numbers! Let's go, come on! 250, 250, 250! Oh, my God! Oh, my God! Oh, my God! Come on, baby! Give me that, give me that, give me that!
Congratulations to you all. Oh, please, please. It is apparent you no longer need my 250,000 contribution. Come on, man, pay up. It was my dream to build a million dollar stadium in Beville, but my contribution will live a short of that mark. So, instead of giving 250,000, I will give 372,000 for a mega stadium right here in Mathis. <laughs> And I'm putting in charge my amazing son, Gabriel, to build that stadium. Geese! Here you go, Geese! And me. All right, uh, enough theatrics with my old man, and uh, I know Devin wanted to come up here and say, say a couple words. Yeah, I do. Devin? Thanks, buddy. Wow. <laughs> this, is, uh, this is incredible. You know, I, I can't tell you what a great moment this is to be a part of. They say that a football team is nothing without his coach. Gotta make you feel like nothing is impossible, like the word doesn't even exist. So, uh, so with that, I'd like to propose a toast to Coach Colton Cruz, the man who saved the Mathis Bullfrogs football team and the richest man in town. Get up here, buddy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> in there, man. What can I say? Um, just thank you. That's it. I think y'all have heard enough speeches from me this year. <laughs> thank you. Good night. Absolutely not. Come on. Come on, coach. <laughs> Come on, Cole. Woo! I don't have my guitar, so on, that coach. ain't gonna happen. What are you doing? Yeah, you know, you know. Seriously? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, this wasn't planned. I, I promise you, it's just this one. <laughs> um, I was inspired by someone recently uh, to write something new, so uh I guess I can do that one for you, huh? <clears throat> okay. <sighs> Here we go. When I was young, I chased the sun and tried to reach the stars and tackled all of my fears. I tried so hard to hide from life and cover up my scars Searching far and wide for a place that's been right here I thought I'd cross the county line and leave this all behind me And give my dark days to the past well, I'd wait under the big bright lights for fame to come and find me But I lost my way Cause light moves a bit too fast well, I've always longed for springtime in the middle of July Or dreamt of mountain tops while standing on a pier But nothing's felt like home and now I know why I'm finally here, I'm finally here, yeah, I'm finally here, I'm finally here. <laughs> <laughs> oh,
Hey, Devin, we have to head back. Colt, great job tonight. You have got a future in coaching, my friend. Let's stay in touch. Yes, sir. Thank you, coach. <laughs> Hope you're ready to tear it up in the NFL, baby. Actually, you know what? For the first time, uh, I'm good here. But go out there and get it this weekend. Well, I'll be watching, all right? You got it, brother. Do us proud, baby. <laughs> what a day. talk football all day but i want to talk about devin wade the person it's a big week your first start in the nfl and you find time to go home and support your community which has been hit hard by the hurricane so tell me devin a little bit about what that trip meant to you it meant the world to me you know we're letting little towns like mathis die which means we're letting communities die now if we continue to let that happen we're only going to be torn further apart as a country when I found out the community was banding together to save the team, I knew I needed to be a part of it. I, I had to be a part of it. Just feel blessed that Coach Cowell felt the same way. It's really incredible. Help shine a light on little old Mathis. <laughs> Great stuff, Devin. I'll get you out of here with a little football, though. When I spoke to Coach Cowher, he said you can morph into virtually any style of quarterback that we see in the NFL today. So I'm asking you, who is Devin Wade, really? I look at the way Cam Newton has changed the game. I mean, teams have to respect his size, athleticism, and his arm. That's the guy I most want to emulate. Hey, you got to respect his hat game too, right? <laughs> awesome. Well, I could tell you, I, for one, am looking forward to seeing you out on the field. Good luck, Devin Wade. Yo, Devin, you get in trouble? Just look for me. Got you. Right, the big game tonight, Charles, and it usually is when these two teams get together, but this one feels a little bit bigger. It certainly does, because normally we're talking about Brady versus Watson, or maybe these two legendary coaches facing off. Tonight, as you suggested, a very different story. Yeah, that big story, Devin Wade facing off against Tom Brady. So the newbie throwing to start the drive, Wade. He's going deep for Brown. And that's caught at the 25. A huge play there for Houston. And even 50 yards. And at this stage, down in the second half, looks like they just wanted to find a way to get it in the hands of their playmaker, and they did. I think you're exactly right. I don't think the coordinator's looking at his play sheet and trying to figure out which play will work well. He's trying to figure out how to get the ball to the playmaker that you just described. Looking down at that sheet, you find people plays, not necessarily X's and O's. And that's it. And got his man. It's caught. Touchdown, Houston. Well, before we put this one to bed, what a game we saw. Any final thoughts? I thought this game was absolutely unreal because Devin Wade made a lot of people believers tonight. And I think he made himself a believer as well. How about that performance? Good game, Devin. Way to play, man. I'm so impressed. Keep it up. You got a great career ahead of you. Good things happen to good people. Hey, I appreciate that, Tom. I love watching you play, man. You too, man. All right, take care. Hey, my dad seriously gave you a loan for this place? Pitched him with PowerPoint and everything. We're partners. My family barbecue recipe and his lemonade. Not that Argentinian crap. Oh, yeah. Ever since that Brango got lifted, he's able to cut costs and pass the savings on to my customers. Hey, Munts. I gotta tell you, man, this place is pretty incredible. Except for the lemonade. That's undrinkable. And why is it $6 a cup? Well, thank you, Cole. I appreciate that. You have to pay for quality. Oh, speak of the devil, ladies and gentlemen, look who we have here. Houston Texans started quarterback, Devin Wade. Uh, well, not exactly. <laughs> All right, so, fellas, uh, it being Thanksgiving, I wanted to introduce you to a guy that I'm truly thankful for. The coach that got me to where I am today. 
Earl Coates. Wow. It's nice meeting y'all. Uh, it's a pleasure to meet you, sir. Well, welcome to Munson's Messy Barbecue. Come for the barbecue, stay for the weirdo company. <laughs> Slogan pending. Thank you kindly. Hey, Dean, I want you to check something out. What do you got, bud? I hung it up. My first decoration. Is it the one that was stolen? <laughs> no, it's the one he signed for me. Oh, that's cool, too, I guess. I would like to apologize for Munz's lack of decorum. Um, it's such a pleasure to meet you. It's a pleasure to meet you, brother. And uh, I was wondering if I could introduce you to somebody. Part of the Weirdo Company? No, actually, a, a young quarterback that I've been working with. Okay. Yeah. How are you, young man? Mind if I sit? It's okay I'm here, right? Uh, yeah, it's more than okay. <laughs> <laughs> Such a dork. You mind if I borrow a loaf for a minute? No, you okay with this? Dad, whatever you have to say, you can say to us. Well, look. It, it's clear you're thriving here. You... you, you you know, the thing is, you got a real good thing going, and and while I don't want to take you away from that... Here comes the butt. While I don't want to take you away from that, I'd like to be part of it. I'd really like to come live here in Memphis. <laughs> you know what? I can't stop you from living anywhere you want in this world. And I know that Lois is a big girl, and I wouldn't dare speak for her. But I can tell you one thing, Cash. I, I will not let you hurt Loretta again. Okay, son. I get it. I really do. I just... I wasted so much time already that I could have been spending with the two of you. And I got a lot to answer for, I know that. I just don't want to waste more time. So... Heck, she can stay with you if that's what she wants. Come on. Come on. Now, what do you say? I think you know very well what I would say. Hello? Of course. Thank you, son. Come on, let's get you something to eat. Okay. Uh, actually, you know what? Just, just hold on one, one second. I will be right back. Hey, Colt. Julia, good to good to uh, see you. Um, thank you for coming down. I appreciate it. I really do. I know you came a long way, uh, but I, <laughs> well, I just got a girlfriend, and uh, I still want to lead you on. So I just want to tell you now, so it didn't get weird later. You know. Great. <laughs> I don't want it to get weird. Okay. Great. Bye. Hey. hey. I think you make it. Glad you came. <laughs> well, Colt thinks I'm here to profess my love. <laughs> of course he does. <laughs> <laughs> it's snowing! <laughs> <laughs> Yo, everybody! Who's ready for a snowball? Come on! <laughs> oh, come on, man. That's from Saint. We're making memories, months. No regrets. Snow in Southeast Texas is crazy. <laughs> Guess global warming ain't all that bad. Come on, boys. <laughs> Shall we? After you. Thank you very much. Nobody knows how the story ends. Live the day through what you can. This is only where it began. Nobody knows how the story.
Texas ain't so bad. Mm, I guess it isn't. 